Good morning, guys. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Um, well, welcome to today's video. It's Wednesday for us, which means that, that we are back at the barn today. We just I'm riding Storm. My mom's riding Sabrina. Are you gonna ride Sabrina today? Yep. Yeah. After my lesson. Yeah. All right. That's working. Just in me, not canter. Yeah. You don't have to canter if you don't want to. But you've been doing awesome at cantering. Yeah. Yeah. Because yesterday Sabrina was stubborn. Yeah, she was super fresh, wasn't she? Anyway, we are still just waking up. Sam and I edit the videos at night, so the girls' first chance to see it is first thing in the morning. So when they wake up, we sit down together and we watch the video. Did you like today's video? Let's see. Oh, yeah. We are headed to the barn this afternoon. First, we have school. Are you ready for school? Sophie's learning times tables. How are you liking times tables? I don't like them. <laughs> do you like anything to do with math? No. <laughs> anyway, I want to show you guys the girls had a bath last night. I want to show you we all have curly hair. Like you can't tell because we straighten it. But every I did I don't straighten it. Yeah, we all have curly hair. I have wavy ish hair. But Sophie has the curliest hair. Sam's dad is Italian and he has really wavy hair. Look at Sophie's hair. Nice. This is Sophie's morning hair. I don't and know she if... had a bath last night. Yeah, she had a bath last night. But this is her hair. If she cut her hair, if she cuts her hair, it gets way curlier. But this is what her normal curly hair looks like. It's just so long and so heavy that it weighs it down. But yeah, she has the curliest hair. Do you like curly hair or straight My hair? Bones are, I think. Her seat bones are like aching. Her seat bones are aching. <laughs> oh my God, my feet should be aching. I was like on the ground for like seven minus two hours. My arms ache. I was throwing water buckets of water over the fence into the water oh trough my and my arms are aching. It's so much work you guys to work at a farm. Isn't it so much work? Like we only showed you a little bit of it because the rest of the time we were working so hard. Like Not mucking stalls. Much. Well yeah, you guys did work because taking a wheelbarrow full of hay in the mud and slush, it took them like 10 minutes to get to the field. It was, it was brutally hard. Did you find it hard? Yeah. Yeah, like all of it's hard. And Every single bit of my body aches. And all the hay was blowing away when we put them down. Yeah. Yeah, it, so we had to put the hay down and then we had to plop on them, like put our knees on them. Is that what you did? Yeah. yeah so that it wouldn't. Um, you sat on them? No, I just put my knees on it so it wouldn't blow away. Yeah, it, <laughs> so it's hard. You sat on them? I wish I had got that on film. My camera came. I feel so bad. I broke the camera last week. It's so bad. When you are a daily vlogger, having a camera is a big deal, and I think it's here. Oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! Yes! Oh, my God. Don't think we were supposed to open that. I had no idea that this was coming. I was not expecting this. Dad's gonna be mad we opened it. Apparently, you guys are gonna be riding a bull all summer. I will. I will. That's so cool. And a camera. Oh, and there it is. This Can't is what I've been it. waiting for. If any of you guys have been wondering, this is the daily vlogging camera that we use. It's the G7X Mark II. And I crashed it this past week when Ru Ruby was getting her hair cut. I broke it. Somebody else likes it when we get packages too, huh? We got mail from Jasmine this week and Jasmine sent us all this stuff. Some Schleich stuff and a bracelet for Gabby. Look at this cool winter tree. And even my dad and my mom got something. Thanks, Jasmine. We needed a dog collar, and this is so cool. And a brush. Oh, that's so cool. Thanks, Jasmine. We are at the barn, and 
Wow, it's a lot better carrying this little tiny camera. Gabby, yesterday I lost the lens cap to my big camera and I went all the way back down two times to try and find it. So see if you find it, okay? All the snow's gone. So maybe that'll help. Anyways, okay, I just have to clarify because I know I'm still upsetting so many people. Storm is Gabby's horse. He's always gonna be Gabby's horse, always. There's no reason to think that he can't jump. He loves jumping so far and he's doing super well. Um, if Sophie's horse, when we get it, doesn't jump or something happens and it can't jump, then they're still gonna need something to take lessons on just for the jumping part. And if they have to take lessons on blue, then they're okay with that. It would be nice though. Yeah, blue jumps like four foot. Five, four foot six. If one of the horses that we get jump can jump, that we can grow into longer. If that doesn't happen, we're okay with that. But if Sophie's horse was a better jumper and Gabby needed to have a lesson on that, then she could. If Gabby's horse was a better jumpy jumper and if Sophie needed to have a lesson on that, then she could. If Fiona said, hey, I have a girl who needs to practice blah 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 and your horse is better at it could she have a, a lesson on him we would say sure go ahead but Gabby's horse is going to always be her horse and Sophie's horse is always going to be her horse and Sophie's experience getting her horse is going to be just as amazing and magical as Gabby's was and maybe even more exciting and magical because Sophie's younger and she has like a even more magical side to her there, he's like, you came to me this time, I'll meet you halfway. Hi, handsome. There's a lot of mud today, huh? Got some cleaning going on. Where'd that helmet go? I thought I threw it out. There's Storm getting all set to go for a ride and Gabby's wearing the wrong helmet. Which I hid. Which we hid away for guests to use. What's my helmet? But you have a new helmet. Not anymore, I got your new helmet. We got Sabrina over here. Getting double groomed. Yes, she's getting the treatment for sure. She's got two people grooming her. Eh? Which I always would pick. Yeah, Sophie's the home picker and I'm the groomer. Well, your mom has to learn the hoof pick. Your mom has to learn the hoof pick. <laughs> I'm vlogging on the new camera. It's so new, it's, it's not even worn in. Everything's working fine with it. And, uh, but let me know in the comments below, what did you think of the quality of the other camera? Because the other camera, I think, took better quality than this one. So I'm going to do the video with the other camera for Laura's lesson. Stormy, can I call you Stormy? Got nice hooves. Hey, look at his hooves. They're like stripes. You have white and black stripey feet. That's pretty cool. Had Sabrina seven months, and out of those seven months, she's wore ear earplugs the whole time. And today, she's not wearing earplugs. Right? Yeah, she's a really nice girl. Now close the gate. All right. Okay, Laura's gonna put on the bridle. I don't think she knows how to do it. We're gonna see if she can do it. Oh, you heard me? <laughs> you heard me, did you? Yeah, she's ready. She's all sad. It only took her seven months to not wear earplugs. It's because she wants to go where Storm is. That's why. Oh. Wow, you're doing it. Can't believe it. I do it all the time. Oh, I never see you do it. You're never here. <laughs> Always here, but you got her here on there. 
There you go, Sabrina, you look good. Thumbs up this video for Laura doing the bridal home by herself. Give me a break. <laughs> Trying to get rid of Laura today. I wanna get to your clothes, gotta get it right now. I wanna push all the limits with you right now. So watch your feelings, the city screaming when I'm coming home tonight. We're living quick in the world, gotta get it right now. People talk and tell what you wanna hear now. But they all disappear, they will let you down so. Entering. Here we go.
so we got really high because she got really quick, and then we tensed up. Yeah. So when she gets quick, think I need to think heavier. Drop that center of gravity back down to the pit. I lose my feet there. Drop your heels. Yeah, the canner is okay. Can't be done Sabrina now. Because she's acting weird. And they want a, a more expert rider to be on her. So she doesn't learn bad stuff. Get him going, man. Walk him around. There you go. Walk him around. What? Walk him around. Go, 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 Stretch go. Stretch your heels to the ground, Jim. Just want to chill for the other horses, okay? I go so.
did a good job today, Storm. Yes, you did. All right, you guys, we're headed down. Storm's walking still. Even though his feet are doing excellent and the farrier left him a little long so he could get used to them. He's having a drink out of a mud puddle. Sophie's brave in it again. And I got Nikki. There we go. I learned to never have expectations when I come for a lesson because it could go good or it could go bad. The problem that I was having with my lesson today was I'm still not good at getting her to canter. And every time I put my leg back to squeeze, I my leg falls back when I'm cantering and then I get feel really nervous. And um, that bumping up and down for the whole like five minutes it takes me to get her to canter is really hard on me. Um, so I always have to stop, which is maybe why she likes me to do that because then I stop. So after my lesson, Gabby got on her and worked with her a little to, on transitions to get her going like she should so that we left her on a good note. Right, Nikki? This is Jessie's horse. Some of you guys have liked Jessie, our friend Jessie at the barn. She has an Instagram account and it is Spicy Hunter underscore, I think is her name. If any of you guys want to follow her account, sometimes she posts pictures of our horses with her horse. And you guys have seen her horse lots of times running into the barn when we do chores at night. Her horse is the one that always tries to run past us and go in first so she can get to the food. Right, Nikki? Is that you? Storm did awesome. I was so proud of him. We all wanted Gabby to jump, the little bit higher jump. And she was nervous and she was working up to it, going the smaller jump, the smaller jump, and then finally she did jump and I was really proud of her. It's hard when you don't trust your horse and um, she doesn't know well enough yet to really trust him yet. Funny how the story goes, little hope but bigger dreams. Uh, they try to bring a sucker down, singing louder than they cry. See you later, Sabrina. Thanks for giving me a ride for my money today. She's like, no problem. She won't even look at me. She's like, I hate it today. <laughs> Bye Storm, be a good boy. We'll see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, thanks for jumping. Spills his food. We are starving. It's already seven o'clock, so. Mom, I need to cancel my lesson tomorrow. Why? Are your legs aching from yesterday? That's the trouble okay, with from today. I'm That's gonna, from today. I'm gonna jump him so I could get all the practice in before Saturday.